Bitcoin halving long term price prediction. Welcome back, guys. It's Crypto Rocco from Rockstar Trading Channel. In today's video, guys, I'll be talking about longer term price predictions. Usually, my videos we talk about quick price moves up and down. This video is going to be slightly different. I want to share with you what has happened to Bitcoin since the previous halvings back in 2012, back in 2016, and the recent one. Look at how much gains we've had and how much gains we can expect. I'll also share with you my thoughts on what's been going on fundamentally i personally trade uh, quickly in and out if you've been following me you guys are aware even now you know we we're in some uh, bitcoin and ethereum short trades and we we look to trade short or long uh, based on that but longer term guys i want to share with you my thoughts and long term i'm bullish guys and if bitcoin you know dumps anything can happen in trading i do hold bitcoin outside of uh, outside of exchanges that i think for longer term investment and i love bitcoin so i want to make a longer term video rather than just shorter time price moves so longer term guys if we go back to back in this is a logarithmic chart back in uh 2012 when we has to, had the first bitcoin halving the price roughly jumped about 10,000 percent and uh, to be fair if you ask me if we're going to see those gains again i'm not sure if we'll get if, if we'll ever see gains like that as the price goes we're not going to see moves like that if if bitcoin uh, had a move like that the price would go to around 6 million which again uh, who knows what's going to happen 20 30 years from now uh, with inflation and the way the governments are printing money i don't know if the price will get to that so that's if you copy what's happened after previous halving we can see that the percentage gain after the first halving had decreased so the last halving uh, bitcoin went up about four thousand percent it's still a huge gain but we saw a, a big uh, reduction in in the price increase so previously it went up about ten thousand percent and then guys it went up about uh, four thousand percent so we can say that roughly the 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 percentage increase again these these are not exact maths i'm just looking at the rough price increases previously and trying to make future predictions i'll talk about some huge implications some things that are going on now with money printing conflicts and you know whether bitcoin is going to be more of a safe haven or it's going to be a uh, more like move like the stock market as a risk asset we're not sure how it's going to perform it's such an early stage there's not much price history on bitcoin as much as we've got in stocks gold and other markets so we're at, we're at still at a very early stage uh, i'm not sure if we'll uh, see moves like we've seen before when price moved up uh, moved up crazy like we've seen uh, back in 2017 are we going to see those sort of moves are we going to see altcoin seasons there's lo lots to uh, lots to look at so we need to see if those happens but i'm just making a rough guide and making a prediction and uh, this is a quick video and hopefully like to hear your thoughts on it as well so the, from the previous bitcoin halving increase we increased about 4000% so that's a roughly um, reduction of 60% of the previous move so if we take 60% less move of 4000 that's about 1600 again these are a very rough uh, price if we go 1600% uh, up from previously we see bitcoin at 154000 uh, in the near future are we going to get that i'm not sure but that's what the previous price suggests um let's uh, let's leave it here it's about 1600 so 150,000 uh, roughly this is showing and and it, how long did it take for it to get there previously it took about a year to get there and and bitcoin halving it took about about a year and a half so could in a year or so time if the if history repeats itself uh, could we see bitcoin at those prices in mid 2021 so that is sort of a prediction looking at what history has done there could be pullbacks we've seen pullbacks uh, but if bitcoin does break out especially about 10,000 I'll, I'll do a short prediction on the shorter term and i'll share with you how exactly i'm trading uh, but i wanted to share with you my longer term prediction because it's more longer term and few things i want to share with you especially the government uh, printing money inflation if we do get something and i'm not an economist i'm not uh, predicting the future with gold i'm just sharing with you my thoughts i do speak to a lot of financial advisors in the cities and have mentors and they some analysts are saying uh, gold can go up a lot more so with inflation could bitcoin go up a lot more as well that is the question 
one thing I'm not going to go too much into this if you uh, compare Bitcoin to the stock market and gold Bitcoin moves similar to the stock market than the gold market uh, bit when the stock market goes down Bitcoin tends to go down and if that continues guys uh, then that's not good we want Bitcoin to be similar to gold so if Bitcoin is similar to gold then Bitcoin could have a lot more uh, price increase if we uh, draw the stock market we can see that roughly Bitcoin dumps have have had similarity especially this one as well this recent dump we've seen is similar to what the stock market has done and if the stock market crashes could Bitcoin crash these are some short-term things we're looking at but longer term again I'm very bullish on Bitcoin what Bitcoin does you know the amount of money printing Bitcoin could be a safe haven in the future so we've already seen countries that are struggling with currencies Bitcoin has been a bit more popular so those are just my thoughts I want to think out loud I want to make a longer term price prediction video shorter time guys I highly recommend you check out our group you can check out our website if you're looking to trade altcoins are going really crazy I'm not sure if we're going to get moves like that. A lot of altcoins are going up and I, I share how I'm looking to trade and I've got a unit section as well and this is Ethereum, uh, how I'm looking to trade Ethereum. There's a unit section if you're new to trading can help you get started with a cryptocurrency course. So uh, let me have a quick share with you my Bitcoin short term strategies and then uh, we'll end the video. So Bitcoin short term guys, I was uh, looking at a short move. I missed the Bitcoin short but I did get the Ethereum short. As at the moment guys if we break uh, back above uh, about 9000 I think we're gonna see a higher move but in the, uh, this is consolidation I'm trading sideways until we get a break below 8200 or a break above roughly 9600 at the moment is consolidation and is scalping zone so thank you very much for watching this video guys I hope you guys have enjoyed it so in the video I want to ask you your price prediction for uh, Bitcoin do you think in the future it will go a lot higher do you think it will move closely to stocks or is it going to move closely to gold and finally guys what is your price prediction for Bitcoin do you think it will get to the 150,000 100,000 and I personally own some Bitcoin and I, I'm, in, I'm heavily bullish on gold with what's going on again I can be wrong uh, but I do think Bitcoin will go a lot higher and if I mean anything can happen Bitcoin could dump to zero even if with cryptocurrency we saw oil going to zero if and if something like oil can go to zero Bitcoin can do do that as well so you need to be aware of the, the risks that you have with Bitcoin but I'm heavily bullish on Bitcoin and invested in Bitcoin and if Bitcoin does have a huge fall it will affect me personally but you know that's a risk I'm willing to take I'm not selling my house and although I did do that it was stupid but you know at my age you know I've not got kids and if you've got people that depend on you your family then you have to you know think about that as well and not just go all in in an altcoin so please do that's the first thing that i try and teach is the risk you we need to be very careful and not invest all your money you need to have a strategy you can use my strategy or your own strategy and manage risk and over time you can learn to trade profitably so thank you very much for watching this video guys i hope you guys have enjoyed it if you have enjoyed it guys smash that like button subscribe to my channel if you're interested in a group or a course i'll leave the links below for you to check out uh, but if not guys all i ask from you is smash that like button subscribe to my channel and turn on the notification button so thank you very much guys uh, smash that like button subscribe to my channel comment below your price prediction and let's have a discussion below thank you very much